Since 1936, the NFL Draft has been held in cities across the country. This year, it was supposed to be held in Vegas. Woo! Vegas! Instead, this NFL Draft will be held in cyberspace. We're <laughs> talking about this from 10 years from now. Some aspects will be normal. 250 draftees, 32 teams, seven rounds over three days, all aired on national TV. But what you'll see on TV will be different. NFL Commissioner Roger Goodell will announce the picks from his home. There will be no arena, no stage, no fans, and there will be no war room for teams to congregate. Cowboys owner Jerry Jones will be in one place, his son Stephen in another. I don't think it's going to be as big a challenge as you might think. A lot of these negotiations are going on uh, outside of the same, uh, same room anyway. And I, I think it's going to work very effectively uh, doing it virtually. Teams will get 10 minutes per pick in round one, seven minutes in round two, five minutes in rounds three through six, four minutes in round seven. And if there is a technical issue or a glitch, the NFL can pause the clock until the problem is fixed. The NFL did a run through earlier this week, but if you've ever used the Internet with multiple devices, you know, things can sometimes get a little glitchy. When we had glitches, uh, we, the key, one of the keys to me was to have backups, backups, backups to execute trades or execute the business of the draft. So the bottom line is we rehearsed that. I'm very comfortable that the technical capability is very much here. Heading into Thursday's virtual draft, the Cowboys are in the right frame of mind, even if they're not in the right frame of the screen. Okay, in Dallas. I'm sorry. Okay, I'm sorry. My bad. I'm Jonah Javad.